first of all, let's just briefly recap what herd immunity is. That's that number that epidemiologists say they think it's around 80%, 85% of the population once they get vaccinated and have immunity to uh, the coronavirus, that it will stop the spread of, of COVID because the virus won't have anybody to jump to. Um, so I had a conversation with someone who said, you know, you know I'm not going to get vaccinated because we're not going to get to herd immunity anyway, right? Um, yeah. And basically what we talked about is, you know, don't really worry about the rest of the country. Think about the people that you interact with the most, your tribe, if you will, reaching herd immunity. So who is that? Those are the people that you spend the most time with, the people that you want to hug, the people you travel with, the people you want to be around, the people you want to get with. It's definitely those people that you live with. And maybe it's the family that you want to see this summer at the family reunion, your faith family, the people you'd vacation with. Um, and, and the booty so, call, and, and the booty call. Let's <laughs> and the booty calls too. Like Dr. Melanie gonna say it like that. Did you, like that, Did but you just bring you up a booty with. call? Like you yes. gonna get vaccinated for a booty it's call? Real. Of course. Yes. Well, who whoever it is, it <laughs> might be your bidwiz partner, it might be your fraternity or sorority, or your golf or fishing buddy. It could be anybody. Okay. But that that's who you need to be thinking about. Do they have? Do you as a group have herd immunity? Because it's those people that right. you interact with that are going to be the most important. And so mm -hmm. if you do your part to protect them, then that's really all you need to be focused on, not really whether the country as a whole is going to reach herd right. immunity.